Well, today we are going to try and take the ferry from uh, Port of San Juan over to Catano. Last time we tried it, it wasn't running because it's some holiday and uh, we don't see a lot of people, so we we'll hope it's running today. Can only hope. <laughs> A quarter, man. All right, here it is. Gonna cost us fifty cents. That'll be it's the ferry terminal. I mean, you just saw the ferry pulling up. Show your age, man. Oh. Because it costs you a quarter. Oh really? Yeah. It costs. It costs you a quarter if, if, if you're uh, over uh, oh. sixty. So pretty nice uh, waiting room. Going on top? Sure, why not? Can't think of any reason. No. Nope. Well, I'm not allowed to. All right. Yeah. Up we go. guys are busy, 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 busy rescuing people whose uh, boats overturned and interdicting uh, illegal migrants who get uh, shuttled over to the to the Mona Island, the Mona Passage, and just get dumped off on the island in the middle there. And here we are. San Juan skyline. And this building right here, I can remember it being the old ferry terminal a couple years ago. I did this maybe about 10 years ago at this point in time. So I put this new one in. And over this way somewhere is the Bacardi factory. I think it's right ahead where we're looking right now. We're heading over to uh, Catano here. Let's get a picture from the other side of the boat. There we go. Coast Guard base. Waiting for the big eagle to get out of the way, towing a boat. There's the entrance to the harbor. And again, old San Juan. No cruise ships here today. That was a little uh, surprising to us. And just coming into the picture. Inside the uh, Catano terminal. This is nice. And out onto the streets of Catano. Back to there. Here's the terminal area. And 
And we're going this way. Place is open. We're in Catanjo today. Looks like a container bay, restaurant rooftop. We have about an hour before the ferry takes us back, so maybe we'll stop in and, uh, and have a drink. But there's our destination right there. The Loblox Bridge. We're way out here. Puente Rosado, and uh, here, you know, this is a legal one and encouraged because they're telling you not to throw your keys you know, into the bay. So they definitely know this is what's happening. They created it for this, and uh, we're not going to be uh, scoundrels and leaving something behind that uh, we shouldn't have left behind, like, like you are in London and Paris. <laughs> bah, bah, Paris. Bah, Paris. Ah, Hamburg city of love doesn't love love locks. All right, here it is. We have to time the waves because it's pretty wet out there. Pretty breezy here today, causing a little bit of wave action. So after the next one comes and crashes, we're going to make a break for it. No dose. Nice. Time to go. All right, fairly dry here. Risa always finds the, the best place for them. Aha! Uh -huh. Where should we put it? This is a nice spot right here. Right here with all these? No, nah, maybe right this below? Is on the second. Yeah. Right below, right here. There it is. Ta da! Maybe we should uh, turn it around. Yeah, I want it facing the other way. Yeah. the ferry. This is a, it's an hour because it's this is the point A Rosado the Catania waterfront. If you don't have a beach you gotta do something to pull the people in. All right, Container Bay. You go in and have a drink. All the other people who are drinking at 2.30. So I'm a terrible YouTuber because I forgot to take a picture of the, uh, the drinks before we drank them, actually. <laughs> <laughs> As I always do, because they come and I just start uh, scarfing them down. But so I actually. So I so I had a Cuba Libre here, because they only serve Bacardi here, and if you don't know anything about the Puerto Rican rums, Bacardi is actually from Cuba, and uh, the the Puerto Ricans don't really like Bacardi because of that fact. But uh, so therefore I had to order a Cuba Libre because they only serve Bacardi in this place. And Lisa ordered a mojito gone it's all gone even the cherry it's not completely gone actually first of all you should know the, we are in catania which is the place where bacardi has a giant factory so outside of this bar that we're in right now which is called the old container or something old <laughs> container rooftop, yeah which our car just came over on a, on a container ship so right. i guess that's why um they have big bacardi signs everywhere and everywhere we everywhere have to be rebellious but you can see if you look very closely here. Is that Don Coo down the bottom? No, it's <laughs> parcha. Ah, parcha. Which is passion fruit. So mojitos, if you're ever in Puerto Rico and you think you need to have a pina colada, what you really need is what Puerto Ricans love, which is mojitos with various native fruits. In this case, passion fruit. Passion fruit, also called parcha, 
is the most wonderful thing you will ever taste in your life. So, when provecho and barza. And over there in the distance is actually the Bacardi fabric, a uh, fabrica, the uh, factory, which uh, produces 85% of the Bacardi rum that's sold worldwide. And Bacardi rum is very good. It's just that Don Cu is the real Puerto Rican rum, and don't let anyone, including Bacardi, tell you otherwise. Yep, that's true. All right, heading on back. Last people with a minute and a half to spare. Hola! Hola! What's that? Um, no, 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 Riva! Uh, Lisa was right. This is like the Staten Island Ferry. This is a commuter ferry. If you look at the times, it goes from 6 to 9 and, and runs from 6 to 9 a.m. and 2 to 7 from San Juan to Catano and 5.30 to 9.30 and 2.30 to 4 and 6.30 going from Catano to San Juan. It's a commuter ferry. It's not just for us tourists. Tourists. So uh, but there you go. it's also for tourists, no question. Now, also the video is that we're advertising the rum factory on vehicles and things like that. Yeah. You definitely know that they got tourists there too. Yeah. But yeah. it was super cheap. It was 50 cents. It probably would have been a dollar if we were under 60. And this, they say it's uh, eight minutes. It took us about uh, 12 or 13. So maybe 14 minutes. And here are the prices 50 cents for the uh, general public. 25 cents each way, We're between 60 and 70. Kids, zero to two, free, and over 71 is free too. All right. So we're just back from our trip to Catano. Spent an hour and 45 minutes, and it cost us a dollar because we got the 25 cent each way ticket because we're over 60. And uh, it was, to me, it was well worth it. I mean, you can go over there, take the ferry, you go, if you have a tour over at, uh, at Bacardi, you can go over, catch a cab over to the Bacardi factory and do your tour. Uh, but uh, we went over for a lock on the, uh, the Love Lock Bridge and uh, had, a, uh, had a drink. An hour and 45 minutes, I saw the beautiful bay, so it was, uh, it was well worth the time well, and, and the money. And also, it was only a 10 minute ride. Yeah. So it was a little, it was too short, but it was very enjoyable. And then when you got there, the other side was actually really welcoming 
we had a drink at one place that looked adorable, but there were five other places yeah. we could have chosen as well. So it's worth it just to go over there and have lunch. Yep, so you'll be over here, over here in the old San Juan. Yep, take the ferry, do something different exactly. and interesting. So, and until next time, may your suitcase always be messy and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. Hasta luego.